Hi guys, I'm Dr. Pooja. So Kathy Griffin just put out a post on Instagram saying that she has lung cancer. So the thing that everybody's gonna be talking about is that in her post, Kathy said that she's never smoked. So how in the world did somebody like her get lung cancer? I'm Dr. Pooja, I'm a board certified physician. Let's walk through this together. So rightfully so, Kathy's concerned. She says that she's never smoked. Like even in her post, she says, I have lung cancer, even though I've never smoked. So what's happening? So yeah, what I want you to know is that yes, 90% of all lung cancers occur in people that have actually smoked. But what I want you to know is that there's a small percentage, so like 10 to 20%, so that's like 40 to 50,000 people per year who develop lung cancer and they have never ever smoked. Don't smoke. Limit your exposure to secondhand smoke. Get your home tested for radon and limit your exposure to any environmental carcinogens. These are steps that you can take to really minimize your risk of getting lung cancer. Kathy's gonna be getting a lobectomy, that means that she's gonna get a piece of her lung removed. The surgery's kind of a big deal. Basically, she's gonna get little pieces of her lungs removed called lobes. So after surgery, a person's usually gonna have a seven to 10 day recovery period. Then there's gonna be lots of imaging, lots of CAT scans, lots of bone scans to make sure that the cancer hasn't returned. Cancer caught early, lung cancer caught early, has really good prognosis. And generally, the types of surgeons that do this type of surgery are called cardiothoracic surgeons. For more medical stuff like this, like and subscribe, and feel free in sharing this with your loved ones. I'm Dr. Pooja. Bye. <laughs>